This bill is going to make it possible for us to continue to build on the workforce that we already have and that we will need going forward. It's going to continue to give us the ability to make targeted investments in organizations that are interested in expanding their footprint here in Massachusetts, either to do research, manufacturing, or discovery. It sort of sends the message to everybody who's playing anywhere in the world in this space that this is a place that's serious about growth here and serious about discovery. Today's bill signing uh, begins a new chapter in what um, I call the Massachusetts way. Uh, in real estate, uh, you know that principle in real estate is all about location, location, location. Um, the Massachusetts way for the life sciences is all about collaboration. Um, this administration has led a new, deep, deep collaboration between industry, uh, government, the private sector, academic medical centers, nonprofit research institutions, K-12 education, community colleges. We have an, an extraordinary way of linking all of these assets together in order to drive this ecosystem. We're here to sign legislation that is going to ensure that we have the best workforce in the world so that we can continue to be the best place in the world for the life sciences. We are the envy of all the other states in the country. We're the envy of all the other places in the world because they don't have the luxury, the benefit, that special relationship that we have here with our partners in government. We have 19,000 students and we receive somewhere close to $200,000 to equip our biotechnology labs. And we've gotten 50 internships with over 30 companies for our students. And we aim to get 50 more 